My name's Dave, and we're uh, located here at the Leo J. Austin School in Whitby uh, for the annual Pine Ridge Railroaders Model Railroad Show. Pine Ridge Railroaders started in 1969. It was formed by a group of General Motors workers and some retired railroad employees, along with a number of others with an interest in railroad. The club reorganized in 1970 and then reorganized again in 1975, and we are now known as the Pine Ridge Railroaders, Inc. Our purpose is to promote fellowship among persons having an interest in any phase of the hobby of model railroading or prototype railroading. We're uh, finding that uh, most of the people who like to come to our show are model railroaders or someone who is really, really interested in model railroading. Sometimes it's dad, but more than likely it's the son or the other way around. that has to drag dad along with him. Even I, as a child, was fascinated with railroading and railroad engines, railroad cars. I think that is one of the prime reasons why today there is such a fascination with the younger kids and with the older fathers that it's a flashback to the 50s, the 40s, the 60s, when there was the real steam-driven, heavy, noisy, smoky engines, and they did the most of the work that brought the east of Canada to the west and the west of Canada to the east and all points in between. My name's Ian and uh, right now I'm uh, operating model railroading and um, I started this when I was five years old and um, I've been doing it for six years now. I prefer HO and N scale but mostly HO because um, it's easier to operate and it's, e it's also easier for um, older people. My name is Hans Hudsonroder. I have been a model railroader for many, many decades. Being 82 right now, I almost forgot how many decades that is, and even as a little kid, I had one of these wind-up locomotives to, to, to pull my cars, and that is way back in the 30s. Okay, you do not model alone. You read about things, you build certain uh, models here and there. It's an over, overall, how would you call that, uh, an overall uh, business more or less. You read, you build, you run trains, you construct things. There's no end to it actually. Even right now, uh, I'm building a module that goes with our modular group and I'm building a harbor. So I'm building some boats as well. Why not? <laughs>